In this video we share Our Lady's message to Pedro Regis for October 1, 2024. Please like, comment and subscribe to assist my channel in reaching a wider audience. Thank you. Here is the message of Our Lady to Pedro Regis for October 1, 2024. Dear children, you are, already, living in the time of the great battle, but the struggle between me and my adversary will still be intense. Your weapon of defense is the truth. Hold the Holy Rosary and seek strength in the words of my Jesus and in the Eucharist. In the great and final tribulation, those who are far from my Jesus will fall to the ground in dread. Listen to me. You have freedom, but I ask you to do the Lord's will. There is no victory without the cross. Be encouraged, and do not retreat. I am your mother, and I will always be at your side. Give me your hands and I will lead you to my son Jesus. God's truth will be left behind, and men will walk like the blind leading the blind. Take care of your spiritual life. Do not leave what you have to do until tomorrow. It is in this life, and not in another, that you must live out and witness to the truth of the gospel. You will yet have long years of hard trials, but those who remain faithful until the end will receive the reward of the righteous. Onward in defense of the truth. This is the message that I give you today in the name of the Most Holy Trinity. Thank you for having allowed me to gather you here once more. I bless you in the name of the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Be at peace. Our Lady Queen of Peace gave a similar message to Pedro Regis on March 5, 2022. That message follows here. Dear children, open your hearts to the call of the Lord. When God speaks, He wants to be answered. Listen ye to Him with docility, and you will be spiritually rich. I have come from heaven to help you. Listen to my appeals, for only thus will humanity find peace. You are walking towards a great war and many will die for despising the weapons of the great combat. Give your best in the mission that the Lord has entrusted to you. It is in this life, and not in another, that you must bear witness to your faith. A great chastisement will fall upon humanity and many will repent, but it will be late. Bend ye your knees in prayer. Behold the opportune time for your yes to the Lord. Be meek and humble of heart and everything will end well for you. Onwards. I will pray to my Jesus for you. This is the message that I transmit to you today in the name of the Most Holy Trinity. Thank you for having allowed me to reunite you here once more. I bless you, in the name of the Father, of the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Stay peace. Thank you for supporting my channel. May God bless you and keep you. Our Lady, Queen of Peace, pray for us.